sandwich generation where you and I are stuck in the middle between our kids and grandkids and our parents and our grandparents and we're just trying to work it up for everyone. Today we're going to talk about more gifts. We're going to talk about happy and healthy gifts that you can give your loved one. Let's unpack it. One of the biggest complaints no, I won't even say that. I will say the number one complaint in senior living is the food. No matter where you go, no matter how fantastic the food is in reality, they will complain about the food 90 some odd percent of the time. Even if they complain of nothing else, even if, even if, whatever fill in the blank thing that is, the food is the number one complaint. Wouldn't it be nice to give them a subscription to something that will drop off freshy fresh food at their door? That is such an awesome gift. And whether you decide to go with a subscription service or whether you decide to get something through Amazon slash Whole Foods where it delivers every so often, or you can use, you know, Tom Thumb Delivery, Grocery Store, Kroger, whatever. Whatever that is for you, think about what they really love, what they're missing, what they complain about, and send it to them. Because uh, most people in senior living have a little mini fridge in their apartment, and you can drop off whatever, and they can eat whatever they want. I mean, there there's no limits in assisted living, let's say, to what you can eat. Now, even if you're a diabetic, you know, we'll suggest to you that you don't eat these things and you may tell us, hey, I don't want anything with sugar and that's fine. But for the most part in senior living, you can eat whatever you want. It's your own apartment. It's your own life. And to have those things would really be a blessing and a gift to those people who really enjoy that freshy fresh stuff. Another thing that you probably don't think about in the healthy department is their linens. You know, everything gets washed and sterilized for that matter in senior living. But how often do you wash your pillows at home? You know, that's just not something you wash every single time. But in senior living, wouldn't it be nice to just drop off brand new stuff for them? They could have all new things, especially now when you can't really just come and go in senior living all the time right now because of the stupid coronavirus thing. You know, think about changing some of those things out. Think about giving them brand new sheets, brand new towels, brand new coverlet for their bed, but pillows especially because those little suckers never get washed no matter where you live in the world. And so something that could be healthy and fresh and wonderful for them. Wow, what a wonderful gift. Another thing that works out great for them is holiday gift baskets. You can buy them or you can make your own so simply. And one of them that works out really well is edible arrangements. Now I will say about those that those are perishable items in an edible arrangement. So where you may be tempted by your heart to spend $150 on this giant edible arrangement, Think about what your senior actually eats in a day and maybe do something more appropriate for what they eat and what they can eat, say, in the course of a week. Because you don't want to put something in there that's going to rot or be funky or whatever. You want to do what's appropriate for their space and how much they eat. But those are fantastic gifts. And if you have someone who likes cookies, those aren't really healthy, but they are on the happy front and they have cookie bouquets that you can make with their name written on them and one with butterflies all over it for my Aunt Lou. Think about their personality and extrapolate that out into the gift you send them. Something else they might find very healthy and happy is a pair of new slippers. You know, they wear a lot of those in senior living and even if it's not fuzzy slippers, but let's say you have someone who's younger or someone maybe who has the mental issue, but their body's great. So they're bebopping around, they're walking all over the place all the time. Maybe in that case, you get them a pair of Crocs or something else that they can easily slide on and off, but brand new, nice and clean, nice and healthy, wonderful things to bring them for Christmas. 
I hope this has helped you. I hope that you have figured out even more gifts for your senior loved one. I know I have for mine. And I'm looking forward to talking to you more about gifts. But for now, as we're running all around figuring out things, let's just stop for a moment. Let's think all these things through. Thanks for watching.